hello everybody welcome back to today's video i'm going to show you how to create this real quick in photoshop it's going to be interesting lesson guys let's start i'm going to photoshop and i'm going to file i'll go to new and then i am going to use these dimensions i'm going to use 2000 2000 here pixels here 300 here and then i am going to call it you know easter post and i'm going to click on create and then i'll go to windows and i'll go to sorry i'll go to view and i'll go to new guards layout i'll set it to six six i'll click on ok all right so let's start now i'm going to use a solid color for the background i'm going to use f f f for e a okay closer to white but it's not white good the next thing is i want to bring in some image there i'll go to place i'll go to place embedded okay and then uh, i'm going to pick my file i'm going to pick this okay i generated with an ai using meta but that's not really important let's flip it horizontal yes that is it and then i want to click on my brush and i also want to give it a mask here yeah, click on the mask set here to color black here okay make sure caps lock is off and then basically you just want to clean around it you want to clean around it okay guys just clean around it we don't need it but clean around it like that good that is it i'm going to the blending mode and i'm going to set it to hard light yep that is it yes man Control t and then let's just increase it all right so something like this i like the crown of the hair to show so something like this is good i love this i love this then i'm going to reduce the opacity over here to around maybe let's say 16 percent sweet so we know it's in there somewhere right that is good now we are going to come back to the background Control g and then let's put it in the background let's call it bg all right sorry let's call it bg okay now we also want to put the cross in here somewhere uh, place embedded we're going to put the cross here somewhere so it should be somewhere like that we can start putting in some text okay but i'm going to keep something here i want to keep my handles over there so that if anybody is looking for me or something like that they can easily find me using that handle i'm going to now i want to type here i'm going to type here and then i'm going to pick the details i'm going to pick i'm going to pick that easter and i'm going to paste it there okay now i want to increase the size of the font a little bit because uh, i want 50 something so let's just use 54 you know it's quite big okay but then the font we are going to be using is second causes sweet guys it's a font it's a font i've never used in this channel before but guys uh, it's new to everything right and then here here let's go to the leading the leading here we are going to set a leading to 66 beautiful go to paragraph and set it to that awesome guys and then let's just click on our move to let's move it somewhere here all right so that is good somewhere there is good also guys you're going to give it a peculiar color i wanted to click on the color here give it five eight two four one nine click on okay yes now we also want to duplicate it and then you also want to open the background and then drag it all the way to the background okay and release it there i want you to go and set it to color white and then i want you to control t and then increase it click on enter click on the move tool and then just move it somewhere here that is it that is all move it somewhere here. that's all close it okay so we have easter here we also can click here and then type maybe let's just say happy but then happy we want happy to um you know we want a different font for it so let's just say we're going to use lato but we are going to increase the font size drastically to maybe around maybe 22 or something like that 
this is good also we can also increase the tracking to 200 to space it out nicely like that and then we can just put it somewhere here okay push it somewhere here in fact we can even give it more 300 nice what is beautiful about it is that you can even decrease it a little bit to make it more you know stand out more so i think this is good we can use this yeah this is good i'm going to push easter in there more um, yeah and then i'm going to drag that one down more all right so i perceive this is good i love this so far um i'm also going to pick my text too and then just just type something there like that i'm going to pick these details and then i'm going to control v to paste it in there now of course i'm still going to use la to but then this is what i'm going to do i'm going to reduce the font size to 11 nice then i am going to um if i let me set the font size to nine make it more small sweet i'm going to set the lady here to 11 rather everything pans out nicely but i'm going to set here to zero um or maybe let's set it to 200 let's set this side to 200 good and then let's drag it here okay i think this is good oh, yeah you're going to push control click on your move to okay and then push it okay now you can see i'm trying to keep it straight line okay with it so that is what makes it beautiful but so guys now this is it um i'm going to put everything in a group and i'm going to call it easter okay so um it looks good it looks good i won't tell you lies now what we can do now is to add some glue to it to push the colors and everything okay now the glues i want to just go and pick yellow color guys make sure you go and look for the yellowish color there click on yellowish color there all right and then just hit there and then go and then set it to linear dodge now you can see the yellowish comes out that's what i'm looking for okay the yellowish comes out so i'll go to s somewhere here and i'm going to paste it there and i'm going to reduce the opacity a little bit now it creates a nice atmosphere there i also come here to the image here and i'm going to click on my brush to set it to black click over here on the mask i basically want to mask this side okay so that only his nose and eyes are showing all right so even if possible we can even increase it more to make it even more epic sweet okay so okay so that is it uh, let's close it and then this we can duplicate it and then we can send it somewhere around uh, let's just see here we're going to give it full color good let's drag it in there guys you can see how it is duplicated all right and then this time send it somewhere here you want to reduce it a bit more okay and then bring it there yeah this is good guys this is good this is good so just these three places and then that's so okay that's so um this one i think i would have to increase it all the way to 100 or oh, this one okay but what i'm going to do is i'm going to decrease it and i'm going to push it somewhere here all right so enter okay so so that is it i'll put it in a group and i'll call it glow we are done with the glow now i want to do something a step further i want to go here to the adjustments and go to gradient map okay now this is to I mean add some sweet colors to it just some few colors i want to add to it b44312 okay so you can see i chose this color for that side but then i'll come here 
and I'll choose FFC 590 over here okay now realize how it's going to change the shadows and the highlights I'll go to soft light okay so now you can see the difference over there that little thing I just did just boosted the colors of that angle now I'm going to match everything together Control alt shift and then E to get it and convert it to a smart object and then I want you to go to filter and then I want you to go to camera raw filter now you're going to do just a few adjustments okay just a few adjustments now the beauty of this flyer lies in the alignment and then the color gradient okay so let's go to contrast here and the contrast I want you to set it to 19 that is all you're not going to do anything else over there go to sharpen sharpen at this side i want you to set it to maybe around 16 there about don't do anything else again and then go to the colors over here click on saturation and then basically play with the colors here okay basically play with the colors here guys just play with the colors okay set it to uh you know as you want to just that's all you have to do all right so I am okay with this and then I'll go to FX here the green here I'm gonna set the green here to 22 and then that is it I'll click on okay and guys that is how you create something like this okay so if you love this video hit the bell icon and subscribe to this channel I uh, love you all guys remember there are more things coming up don't want you to miss it so subscribe and comment as well peace out